you finished yet? I'm almost done, Phantom. I'm just grabbing a couple more clothing items. Bella, we're only gonna be gone for two or three days, not a whole year. Ugh. Every minute that passes by, I'm gonna charge you an extra five dollars. Cause I'm broke and I gotta pay my bills. I need money. Okay, I'm coming. I'm gonna miss my house. I know it's gonna be only two days, but like, I haven't been on a road trip in like years. Hopefully nothing bad happens. <laughs> Let me turn off my lights. There we go. Let me close my windows and doors. Gotta make sure no robber sneaks in my house. I think I got everything. Okay, Phantom, are you ready to go? Yeah, girl. I was born ready. Finally. Jeez, I need longer. I thought I was probably gonna fall asleep standing up. Don't worry. The only one that's gonna be sleeping is the person not driving. Yeah, that's true. You're gonna drive, right? What? Okay, fine. I'll drive. But if we get into a car accident or something, just know it's not my fault. Okay, we need to put the last things in the car. Oh my god, why did you bring so many boxes? And then you're saying that I'm the one that thinks I'm gonna be moving? Listen, girl, if I'm gonna be out in the wilderness, I gotta be prepared, you know? You never know. I'm probably gonna be hungry, poor, I need some soap, you know? Let me just put this in the trunk then. Let me get this other box. There we go. Well, Phantom, don't just look at me. Help me put boxes in the trunk. <laughs> There we go. I think that was the last one. Okay, make sure you're not missing anything. Like my sanity. I mean, <laughs> no, not missing anything. Okay, I'm gonna lock the house now. There we go. Let's go. So excited. I can't believe we're going on a road trip. Road trip. <laughs> I remember the last time we went on a road trip. We went to a motel and we almost died, but that was an accident. Well, guess what? That was not my fault. That was yours. You wanted to go to the Angel Hotel so bad, and look, we went to a dump. Well, you know what, bestie? We're bad not to get into any trouble this time. Okay, and Jesus, you need to learn how to drive. I don't know how you got a license. <laughs> For your information, I got my license like a month ago. So technically, I can't drive. When'd you get your license? Clown school, maybe? Wow, you're supposed to be supportive of me. I am supportive, girl. Are you trying to kill me? How am I supposed to support you when I'm dead? Oh, you're right. Bestie, also, did you get some gas? Because we're gonna be driving for a couple of days. Oh, yeah, I totally forgot. I think we should stop at the gas station for a second. Oh, and we could also get some snacks at the mart or something. Ooh, that's right. They added a new mart. I can't wait to go in there. I think it should be right over here. Oh, good thing the gas station isn't that full today. Stay in the car, and what snacks do you want again? Ooh, get me the blue Doritos. I love those. They're really good. Okay, okay, okay. I'll be right back. Oh, and get me some chocolate, too! And soda! Oh, my God. You sure are an expensive being. Mmm, this hot dog looks so good. I love hot dogs. <laughs> I wish hot dogs were human so I could date them. Okay, so what do I need? The blue Doritos that Phantom wanted. Okay, so some soda. And maybe we need some water as well. Okay, so what else do I need? Hey, Bella. What are you doing in a place like this, huh? Uh, Rade. Hi. Why do I keep seeing you everywhere? You're like stalking me or something. Well, this town is the size of a penny, so you shouldn't act so surprised, baby girl. <laughs> or maybe it's just destiny. <laughs> Yo, Brade. Yo. So what brings a fine lady like you to the gas station? huh? Dude, because I need gas. Oh, you need gas, huh? I think I can help. Smell that. Those are my pheromones. <laughs> Did you just fart in front of me? <laughs> smells like sewers. You can thank the hot dogs for that one, baby girl. Just for you. <laughs> Did your parents not teach you manners? Well, actually, my dad and my mom were in jail for like all my life, so I had to learn my own manners. <laughs> yeah, they sure didn't really learn a lot. So, you want some hot dogs? Yeah, um, um, no thank you. Besides, I'm pretty sure you touched them all and filled them with your cooties. I'm gonna go back to buying. <laughs> Wait, Bella, where are you heading? Just kidding curious, you know. Um, I'm heading to Nanya. You know where that is? No. Where's that, silly? It's Nanya. None of your business. Wow. Aggressive. I like that. Oh, you're so gross. Just get away from me. Fine. Ah, uh, at least my iconic chick mobile will keep me company. Bella, hurry up. <laughs> I'm hungry and dying in this car. Where the heck is the AC? Wait, Bella's with someone else? How dare she? I think I have an idea to get Bella's attention. If she doesn't want to come to my house on her own, I guess I'll have to give her a good reason to. <laughs> uh, is my car not working? Why are you taking so long? 
Hey, handsome. I've seen you around before. Oh, hi. Aren't you Brene? Didn't we get kidnapped together? How did you escape? <laughs> you know me. I have my ways. <laughs> Speaking of, like, kidnapping and stuff, I think I got something to show you. Sure. Uh, what is it? <laughs> Check this oh. one out. Ow! Bella, help me. Damn, you're kind of fat, bro. Me and you are going to have a good time at my house. <laughs> okay, try this pink credit card instead. This one should definitely work. Okay, there we go. Oh my god, finally. Poor Phantom. Oh, look, for day left. Good. Let me pump in the gas. There we go. Hang in there, Phantom. I'm so sorry about the AC. Okay, there we go. It's full. Okay, Phantom, we can go now. Wait a second. Phantom? Where the heck is Phantom? Oh my god, did he really ditch me or something? But, like, Phantom would never do that to me. Let me call Phantom. He better reply. Pick up, pick up, pick up. I can't believe he left me alone at a gas station. So many crimes have happened at a gas station. What the heck is all that noise? Oh, looks like somebody's getting a phone call. Let me just get that for you, buddy. <laughs> Hello. It's Brede here. Who's this? What the heck are you using? Oh, your friend? He's just having a little sleepy time, if you know what I mean. <laughs> Bro, I don't know what you mean. What is going on? Oh, sorry. I don't think I was clear enough. I just knocked him out with a wrench and kidnapped him. I'm taking him to my house now, girl. <laughs> Wait, what? You kidnapped my friend? Are you psycho? Yeah, girl. If you want to see your friend ever again, you better head to my house. Oh, and wear something cute. <laughs> what? know where you live well you better start looking baby girl <laughs> Ugh, are you kidding me he just hanged up on me well phantom looks like someone really cares about you can't really say the same for me but whatever <laughs> you know what you're actually like such a good listener wow i should have kidnapped you sooner <laughs> So anyways, let me tell you the story about how my parents left me. <laughs> Stupid idiot! How dare he kidnap my friend! He basically ruined our weekend. The thing is, Panda's on vacation, so I don't even know who to ask to help me find my best friend. You know what? I'm an independent woman. I don't need anybody. Besides, I've seen a lot of CSI in Miami, so finding a missing person shouldn't be a problem. Okay, I better head home. I'm gonna have to print some missing person posters. Can't believe my life has come to this. Yeah, I don't think Brede is gonna do anything bad. But I still need to find my friend. Okay, so first I need to find a cute picture of Phantom so I can put it on his missing poster. Because if it was okay and he saw a poster with an ugly picture, he would hate me for life. Now I need to go to my computer and print out the missing sign. Here we go. Let's just start printing this. Okay, now I need to start putting these around town and ask people if they've seen him anywhere. Okay, let me lock my door. Phantom! Bessie! I promise I'll find you! Ugh, I'm not gonna take this car. Let me go get my Jeep. At least now I'm gonna find my friend in style. But anyways, where should I go to first what if i go to my creepy neighbor's house the one that kidnapped me if he's a kidnapper then he should probably know about what kidnappers do oh my god i'm so smart <laughs> Ugh, his house is so creepy. I should just be grateful, though, that I'm alive. Let me see if I have a gun or something in my trunk to make sure I don't die. I got a gun, but I'm gonna put it away. But it's good to have in case I need it. So much better than that stupid banana phantom trying to bring me one. As if that was gonna do anything. What's all that racket? Do I have a visitor or something? No, no, it's probably just the mailman. Oh, this place stinks, man. He needs to throw out his trash. <coughs> Open up! Creepy guy! Come here! Uh, hello? Wait a second. Aren't you the girl I kidnapped? Yeah, but guess what? You're not gonna kidnap me anymore because I got a gun. Don't kill me. I mean, I just wanted to be your friend. Don't try anything. Bro, why are you on my property then? Well, my friend actually got kidnapped and since you're a kidnapper, then I wanted to know what a kidnapper would do and how I can find my friend, basically. I think I can help you. Just step right on it. No, I'm not going inside your house i'm not stupid and remember i have a gun so come out here now oh well i see you are getting smarter the kidnapping was good for you good 
character building exercise. But anyways, here is a missing side of my friend. Have you seen this person before? Do you even know who kidnapped your friend? Oh yeah, I do. Today, it's this other guy you kidnapped. Oh yeah, yeah, I remember him. Nice kid. He's literally a creep. All he does is hit on me, and now he stole my friend for some reason. How do you think I can find him? Well, best advice I can give you is go to his house. I don't know where he lives. Well, better figure that out. See ya. Ah, uh, this creepy guy was no use. Hey, I can still hear you, you know. Ew, stop staring at me. Remember, I have a gun. Don't mess with me. Oh, okay, never mind. Where should I stop to next? Oh, wait, I know where I should go. The hair salon. I mean, Phantom's always trying to look like a baddie. Someone here has to know him. Ice Spice? What are you doing here? It's you. <laughs> hey, girl. Look at you. You look nice. Yeah, I look pretty good. But wait, I thought you hated this place. Why are you working here now? Remember when I said that I had some business to take care of? Let's just say <laughs> the business has been done. <laughs> so why are you here, baddie? Are you here to get your hair done again? Remember, this time you have to pay. I don't really need to get my hair done. Here's the thing. My best friend is missing, and I'm trying to find him, and I'm asking around if anybody's seen him before. Here, grab this missing book poster. And he is not a baddie, and he's not a 10, and he don't even look like he got money. Sorry, girl. Ah, uh, that's rude. That's my best friend. I'm gonna put my poster up in your wall, if that's okay with you. Yeah, go for it. I have some business to take care of, you know? <laughs> so don't mind me. <laughs> take care. What the heck? Oh my god, I need to go. Let me stick a poster right here. Okay, I better go somewhere else. Where else could I go? Uh, yeah, okay. I think Phantom's been to the spa many times before, so might as well leave a poster in there. Anastasia? It's you, the American with the Mount Everest pimple. For your information, I don't have the pimple anymore. Why are you here today? You have no reservations to be here. Well, I'm actually not here to get service today. Instead, my friend is actually missing. Have you seen him before? So what you're telling me is you're wasting my time. I'm not wasting your time. There's a missing person. This person is ugly. I have not seen your friend. Mount Everest. Thank you, I guess, for your time. Stop! Come here! What? What do you want? What happened? Remember what I spoke to you about, about my cousin. Six, four, blonde hair, blue eyes. And I must say, he is very hot. Hey, yo, woman! You shouldn't be saying that about your cousin! You Americans are too sensitive. Are you sure you're European and not from Alabama or something? <laughs> are you sure that you're not from Ohio? I heard those people are strange. Ah! Uh, okay, that's kind of rude. I take my joke back. Please date my cousin he needs somebody well, i don't know maybe i'll think about it american give me your number so that i can give you a call here's my number 407 12 13 not 69 69 got it boss i need help extracting this pimple it's so big and juicy just like her booty <laughs> my delicate flower is here if she finds out that it was this fat man that took care of her he will ruin my business i better send her off before things get bad. Listen, fat man, let me show you my gratitude by getting back to work. Get out of here. Oh, get not the mop again. And you, I'm done with you. I have nothing more to say. Now get out. Okay. She's lucky she's pretty. How the heck am I gonna find Phantom? I have no idea where Bredet lives. Ew, this place is disgusting. Bredet, why did you kidnap me? Why didn't you just kidnap Bella? I just wanted to get Bella's attention. Although, actually, you know, kidnapping her might have been a better idea. But why don't we be good friends? If you wanted to be my friend, you could have just asked, Bredet. I've totally forgot about that. Hey, Phantom, you want to hear a knock-knock joke? Uh, sure. Why not? Knock 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 who's there hugh hugh who you have a amazing smile <laughs> anyways that hits the spot right there <laughs> hopefully phantom doesn't have to go after me He'd probably pass out <laughs> 
Can I use the bathroom? <laughs> no. You ruined my road trip, and you're not gonna let me use the bathroom? Okay, fine. But only because I don't want to lose points with Bella. <laughs> Uh, I hate my life. Ah, sorry, I must have forgotten to flush that. Let me get that for you. Okay, have fun in here. Where the heck would Bradet even live? He has no friends, no family. Where could he be? Wait, he probably lives in the middle of nowhere. Okay, let me just get out of town for a second. So, Phantom, how do you like my cooking? <laughs> God, Bidet, actually, you cook exceptionally well. You're actually pretty cool, Bidet. I'm sorry that I was thinking less of you. Don't worry about it. Everyone looks down on me. That's why my parents went to jail and abandoned me when I was six. <laughs> I'm not gonna abandon you. Can Bella also be my friend? Yeah, um, that's gonna be a lot of convincing, but sure, I'll try. <laughs> Thanks, buddy. But it's already getting really dark. I really need to find Phantom. Oh my gosh, he's been missing a lot of hours now. Wait a second. Isn't that the car I saw at the gas station? Oh, that says Chick Mobile. Nobody else is gonna use that except for. <gasps> Brede! Let me get my gun. I don't have to use this. And so then I said, show her. I barely know her. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, Brede. You're actually really funny. <laughs> Wait a second. That sounds like Phantom laughing. I can recognize that hyena laugh from like miles away. Wait, let me get closer. <gasps> oh my gosh. Poor Phantom. He's held hostage and he has to eat with. Per day? That seems awful. Oh, I accidentally hit the window. I hope I didn't hear that. Wait, did you just hear that? I don't think so. Let me just go check the window real quick. Well, well, well. Look who's here. Let me go say hi. Hey, Bella, baby girl. Ah! <laughs> uh supposed to be behind the box you're not supposed to see me but anyways give me back my friend right now you look so hot holding that gun you should be a cop and like totally arrest me <laughs> ew you're so weird give me Banta back i know you held him hostage he's probably suffering and so sad actually we're having like a really pleasant evening and we're really good friends now dude you have to be delusional take that oh stay there or else i will shoot you. Aggressive. I like that. Oh, Phantom, Phantom, are you okay? Uh oh, hey, Bella. Why are you so peaceful? Yeah, he ended up uh, not being a bad person after all. Um, I, I kind of knocked him out with my gun. Bella, where did you even get a gun? I needed it too because I visited Phil. You visited the crazy guy? Yeah, to try and find you. But anyways, let's just go. Come on, let's go. No, Bella. You want to stay with Brede? I mean, he wasn't a bad person. He made me food. I'm so confused. I really think we might have misjudged him. Fanta, he kidnapped you. If he wanted to be our friend, he didn't need to kidnap you. Well, guess what? It took him kidnapping to find out that he's a good person. Oh my god, maybe I should leave you here. You're kind of delusional. Brede, wake up. Now I feel bad. Brede, are you okay? True. Loves... Yes. Yeah, never mind. I think he has to stay dead because I'm not kissing him. Wait, wait, Bella. What do you want? Can I uh give you a hug? <laughs> Bella, just hug him, make him happy. Kick him where the sun doesn't shine in case he does something to me, okay? Here you go, Bridget. Oh, you smell so nice. Do not kidnap me, my friend, ever again. Or else you know what's gonna happen to you, right? <laughs> okay, noted. Hey Bella, do you still have those blue Dorito chips? <laughs> Ew, your laugh sounds just like him. Nah, I'm leaving you here with him. Goodbye. Eh, okay. 